What's up, what's up everybody? I am so excited today to bring you a video on Wedgie the Light Horus. It's, his name may as well be Wedgie, okay? So I'm very excited to be doing a spotlight on Wedgie. Thank you, Senpai. Senpai Kitty, that's what I like to call her. Uh, for letting us use your Light Horus. She always gets the best light and dark monsters. I'm so jealous. Alright. So what is uh what does Wedgie do? <laughs> what does Wedgie the uh, light horse do? He's got the well first he's got the leader skill increases the accuracy of ally monsters in the arena by forty percent. Okay, he has overpower deals damage to an enemy and with a fifty percent chance decreases its attack bar by thirty percent. Okay, good first skill kind of like uh kind of like Ramagas. Well, Ramagos and who else? Who else? Who else does this? I'm trying to think who else has this first skill. I don't remember. But uh, the the War Bears first skill. Uh, we have defensive stance increases the defense of allies for two turns and decreases the chances of them receiving critical hits uh, for two turns. Reusable in five turns. Okay. So defense buff and anti crit. This is awesome. You could use this in giants or dragons. Or arena. I see some. I see some uses for this uh, in arena. Okay, and then we have duty of the monarch passive recovers the attack bar of the ally with the lowest attack bar by twenty five percent and it increases that ally's attack power for one turn. This seems like this seems like okay. Well, you re recover the attack bar of the ally with the lowest attack bar. Okay, and increase that attack power. That's kind of like Konamiya, right? Yeah, but this is his passive. So every time he moves, he gets this. So I think for dungeons, definitely violent with high speed. Lots of speed, lots of speed, lots of speed. Um, this is nice. He doesn't need accuracy necessarily. You could put him with an accuracy team. Kind of. But he doesn't necessarily need accuracy himself, I don't think. I don't think this is enough to warrant, like, let's focus on focus runes. Ah, uh, that's a joke. That's a jokey, funny joke. Okay. But... But I was thinking about this, his, uh, his passive. And his second skill... Um... His second skill's really great. Decreases chances of them receiving critical hits. Are we not gonna load the dragon? Come on! Come on! Oh my god, take your time. No. Don't worry, sweetheart. Take your time. Come on, come on, come on, come on, you could do it, you could do it, you could do it, oh my god. <sighs> Fucking loading. But, I was thinking about, I was thinking about his second skill, and I was thinking about his passive, and I was like, wow, you know be really awesome is for arena defense, let's, uh, let's auto this, let's see how it, uh, let's see how it works for dragons. We could do another, we could do another spotlight in the, oh, she's got, nice, oh, God, did you see that? Did you see that three attack age buffs? Come on. Violent runes for the win. Violent high speed. Okay, so violent high speed is what I think for dungeons. For arena, I think this would be really, to make this really, really fast, like, um, like, just swift with as high speed as possible, like a Bernard or like an Orion, and have a speed leader. What would that do? Okay. What would that do if you have a speed leader, and you have Wedgie, and he attacks first? Uh, with swift runes. Okay, so he attacks first, and then whoever... And you can choose your arena defense. You could say, okay, this is this monster, this is this monster. You can see who has the lowest attack gauge. You already know the first turn, you know who's going to have the lowest attack gauge. So he will buff up, so they don't need swift runes. They can attack second, just because he's got the passive that's going to activate whenever he gets a turn. So you have the two-turn advantage. Not, not the two-turn advantage, you have the advantage of two monsters that you have having their turns first before the enemy has a turn. Which is, which is really cool, which is really cool. Um, similar to Bernard, but uh, when Wedgie attacks first, he could put that defense buff and uh, crit resist on. Like that, right there. Uh, so he could do that. So then you're gonna have, okay, you're gonna have problems with the, the teams, like the Galleon teams that are going to come attack you, it's like, okay, well, we could defense break, 
but you still have the defense buff on there so really doesn't do amazing for us and then you have the crit resist too so if you have like a galleon xeros it's like oh damn well okay so they got the first turn they got the defense buff and they got the crit resist and it's gonna be hard to i think i think it would be hard to one shot i think it'd be a nice uh, a nice first thing plus if you have let's say let's say you use like a speed leader and then you use wedgie and then you have like maybe a vertiheal in there but you have vertiheal on violent and the vertiheal has out of the four monsters there he has the lowest speed but he's got still high speed but the lowest speed out of them wedgie attacks first he buffs vertiheal speed vertiheal does his little ching 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 and he violent procs because of course vertiheal always violent procs see see three times Okay, and then he does that, and then the rest of your team attacks again, and then Wedgie attacks again on top of that, because Vertiheal just buffed his attack age up, and like, I think that could be just, what the hell, like, just like, oh my god. So speed leader, see, Vertiheal again, attacking again. So, so yeah, I think, I think with that team would be, would be something to see, do some crazy, crazy stuff. You, I mean, the, 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 the amount of turns you can get before they can even move, I think, would be ridiculous. But we're seeing, we're seeing Wedgie is doing great already. So, yeah, I think Violent for dungeons, probably. And then I would maybe even want to go Swift. I would maybe want to go Swift and whatever subset. Maybe, no, you know what? I was going to say whatever subset, and then I'm like, no. Maybe Swift Nemesis, just to give him more chances to get more turns. You know, like a passive way to increase his speed. Every time he gets hit, you know, his attack age goes up, gets more turns. Every time his attack age goes up, he gets a turn, and someone else gets an attack age going up. So I think for arena defense, he could be awesome. Awesome. I think, yeah, speed leader skill, wedgie, vertiheal, something else. I haven't decided who else would be awesome to put with that yet, but, um, but yeah... Wait, you need you need something with a defense break too, probably. So, my God, my God, that went pretty well. We kind of Spectre was gonna was gonna die a little bit at the end. Okay, let's go to community, Communite, and we'll go to. I know she never does arena, so I know where to find her. Yeah. <laughs> Surprising! <laughs> I said she doesn't do arena. <laughs> so. Alright. How does she have Wedget Rune? Oh! <gasps> not enough speed. Okay, so she does have she does have Nemesis on him. I didn't even notice. So actually she has uh she has pretty good runes on him. S uh violent nemesis is gonna give him is gonna give him as much he's gonna get the most turns that way. This is how he's going to get the most turns. So that's actually really good. Let's see what we have here. Oh, it would be nice to get the substats on here suck, though. The substats on here suck. It would be nice to get speed on here as a substat. That's what I would go for. And we have what we have here. HP, attack, crit, damage, crit. Speed again on here. Speed, speed, speed. Speed, 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 speed. Speed, speed! Did I mention speed? And then what do we have here? Speed. Oh, we could get... Don't even upgrade this anymore. You get a better rune with speed on here too. Speed, speed, speed! Speed, speed, speed! Speed, speed! And then, uh... Well, I mean, she's, she's at least has speed on the 1, 3, and 5, right? Oh, accuracy, attack, and resistance. But speed, speed, speed. Speed, 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 speed. Yeah, we want this guy to attack as much as possible. He still does it. I mean, you see he did Dragon's B10. And I think Violent and Nemesis is a good uh, rune combination. With a speed on 2 is great. That's actually a pretty good rune. Defense, HP, crit damage. Adds, and a speed uh, primary stat. It's a good rune. Uh, let's see his skill ups. So, getting some, getting some Devil Mons there. Oh, maybe she stopped, actually. Maybe she stopped after that. Or maybe she's still putting devil. I'm not sure if she's still putting devil mons into him, but yeah, 
Uh, this is the this is the important one that I would want to see Devilmons into, and of course we got him. We got him. But I think speed, 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 speed on him. Speed, speed, speed. Violent Nemesis for uh, for dungeons for arena defense. I think Swift Nemesis would be Swift Nemesis with a speed leader skill. Forget about it. GG. You have to get him fast, fast, fast speed though. Fast, fast speed. And you could you could kind of play around with it to see to see how uh, how it could work good, but the possibilities with that the possibilities are beautiful. I think I think he would be so fun. It would be. I hope I can find one in arena defense that's ruined like that and attack it and get wrecked so I can show that on video and be like, ah, oh, god damn it, they wrecked me. Because I think it could be, uh, like with a really fast, really fast, um, really fast wedgie and, uh, and a speed leader, I think it would be pretty crazy to fight against. They would just get so many, they would get the, the, fr the turn advantage and they would get more turns on top of that and... With a violent, he would work with a violent vertiheal. That's not the fastest monster in your team in your lineup, because you, you you want you want to make sure you have that turn that turn order correct to do um, to just be ridiculous. But I think that'd be pretty fun. All right, guys, <sighs> that's that's it for Wedgie. That's it, Wedgie. That's it, Wedgie. I like you. You're all right. You're all right, Wedgie. Yeah. Ah, you're all right, Wedgie. All right. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, as always, th oh thank you, thank you Senpai Kitty for letting us use your light horse. I'm jealous, you always get the good stuff. And as always, I will see you guys in the next video.